at number one, Caleb Williams going to the Chicago Bears. They did it. Did they finally get a guy who can throw for more than 3,600 yards a year and maybe go over 4,000 and be the best Bears quarterback in history? Not in year two, not in year three, like we see with some of these quarterbacks, but in year one. Well, I mean, he's got not one, not two, but three great receivers, Keenan Allen, DJ Moore, and now Roma Dunze. They got DeAndre Swift at running back. They addressed the offensive line. On the other side of the ball, Montez Sweat, we saw how that defense came on last year. So I think like it would be honestly a disappointment if he didn't throw for 4,000 yards and break every single record that they've had to this point. So I think the Bears found their guy. And if he ends up panning out in the NFL, they're going to be really good for a while. Yeah, they will be really good for a while because not only do you have Keenan Allen, who is not your one, not your two, but he's probably your number three or fourth option because not only do you have three really good receivers with Romeo Dunze, DJ Moore, kind of all at different points in their career where we have the guy who's kind of still hitting his prime in DJ Moore. We have the veteran in the room in Keenan Allen, and he doesn't need to be on the field every single time, and we can keep him healthy for the playoffs. And then we have Romeo Dunze, who's going to be able to learn from DJ Moore, learn from Keenan Allen, and then you have all three of those guys, and then, oh, yeah, we forgot about Cole Komet. Cole Komet, who is the luxury, the most underrated tight end. We are talking about him being the most underrated tight end in the league three years ago, and then last year, we see articles popping up everywhere about Cole Komet being the most underrated tight end in the league, and, oh, yeah, you got some killers on defense in the draft as well. This might be the year the Bears do something. All you need to do is actually put a bear in your helmet, update your uniforms. Why are we Bears but blue? But overall, this team has a pretty good chance. Really, the only one who can mess this up at this point is probably um, the head coach at this 